<laughs> Look at her go. Look at her go. She has no idea we're about to talk so much shit about her boyfriend. Hey guys, it's me Tara. Welcome back to my channel. We are doing trash talking our boyfriends, but a little different edition. Oh, by the way, I'm with Neza. Hi. Neza, who are you dating? Um, I'm dating Crawford Collins. God bless him. I know. <laughs> guys, I'm vlogging because we're gonna go get little acai bowls from Sun Life and because Harry's tour, my pre-sale starts in 15 minutes. Basically, we're cutting it real close. We're cutting it real close. And we're kind of panicking because Tara literally has to somehow buy tickets within 30 minutes. So you guys are gonna join us for that too. <laughs> and then we're gonna trash talk our boyfriends. Boyfriends. Hey, what is going on in here? What is, why do you have a stroller? <laughs> Surprise. Do you have a child? <laughs> what is no, it? it's for my dog. That's weird. It's sugar stroller. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Watermelon Sugar High is playing at They're Sunlight. They're literally playing her. Um, I almost said Harry Potter. I think it's a sign. I think it's a sign I'm gonna get these tickets in 10 minutes. 18 minutes. Guys, Tara is literally sitting on the floor waiting for these Harry tickets. Like about it. <laughs> no, literally we came at the worst possible time. This but... was the worst possible timing in general. We're supposed to be trash talking right now. Okay, I got into the no, waiting room. No, it just like, it just fell off one day. Neza is arguing with someone. I hope it's Crawford so we have tea for the video. I promise the trash talking will start ASAP after I get these tickets. There's four, There's four minutes left. I know this isn't the video you guys clicked, but it will be in a second. I promise. I'll be extra angry at Crawford if we don't get these tickets. Right. Okay, I'm literally like 700th person in line, but like, I think we got this. Yeah. Guys, I got him. Thank you, Neza. I got him, but I'm not sitting close, but I still got him. Let's get to the Let's talking. Get After all that, we got the Harry tickets. Welcome to trash talking our boyfriends. Yup. You're my second guest on this. Who did it first? My friend Devin. Okay. I've known Devin for a long time. So we had, and our boyfriends were roommates. Oh my God, they were roommates. So we had a lot of crap to right. talk. Now with you, since our boyfriends have more recently started hanging out like a lot more, we have realized how similar they are. So I'm gonna get started with the questions. Okay. <laughs> There's only a couple, I'm gonna delve into them. Right. Okay, well who are you dating? We know. What? Okay, I don't I don't know. Does he have any nicknames? Crawfish, I don't know you know what I call him and he hates Crawfish, it? DJ Crawfish, he hates it. And you know what he hates when I call him? What? Crawfart. <laughs> What is the most annoying thing about Crawford? He's not as annoying as people would think, but he also is. Crawford is the type of person to likes to annoy people. He gets like a crack at it. Oh, those people drive me nuts. You know what I mean? Sometimes There's many things. Where I'm like somewhere, you're like, dude, like I'm at a party. You're like, when did you, like, why didn't you tell me about this party? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Thank you. Yes. Baby, sorry if you're watching this, but one of the most annoying things is Crawford, and he's gotten better. Very okay. okay. But, um, very early on into a relationship. Bad change, ma'am. Crawford has this habit of not letting me know about things. I mean, you know. I know. Sometimes a lot of things get planned in the boys' group chat. Oh, yes. And we don't know anything. We, until, we know nothing. Until two minutes before the thing starts. Uh, and you know, that wouldn't be a big deal if we were a guy. Right, you just throw on a t-shirt. Shirt, hat, no, anything. No, no. But me and Tara have been in a situation where we're like, did you know about it? No. No. Um, literally, oh, speaking of the devil. Um, literally. Answer, answer, answer. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hey, baby. Hi. I'm here filming with Tara. We're here talking about most annoying things about our boyfriends. What the? Don't freak out when a video comes out and it's called Trash Talking Our Boyfriends. <laughs> Sorry. What? It's a series what? I do. I don't know what you did to sugar, but you just sent sugar on a whole rampage. Okay, I love you. I love Goodbye. You. So yeah, sometimes Crawford doesn't relay the information and he thinks I'm gonna hear it from like a third party, but then I don't. <laughs> like what third party? I now? don't know. I don't know. I, you know, he'd be like, "Oh, by the way, this is happening tonight," and I'll be like, "How long have you known?" And he'll be like, "A couple days." And I'm like, "A couple of days." And that group chat. You know, sometimes I just want to be a fly on the wall in that group me chat. Me too. Okay, okay, what's the most annoying thing about Jake? Or is this just you interviewing <laughs> me? Well, I mean, like, I'll, I'm gonna contribute for sure. Okay. When I tell him something, like, "Hey, clean the house," he just doesn't. It's like talking to a wall. <laughs> Crawford can't multitask. Oh yeah, it's no, but it's really bad. I just hate like telling him to do something and he doesn't do it. I'm like, you have to do this and he doesn't. It's like talking to a wall, honestly, sometimes. Really tall wall. Who says, I'm sorry, <laughs> not sugar shark. <laughs> not, not careful sugar with that thing. Right. You know a fan sent me that like a long time ago? <gasps> not for sugar, like just Does for she me. know? I think her name is Brittany. Okay, well Brittany, if you're watching this. This is sugar's favorite. We ended up having to buy like multiple off Amazon. Who out of you and Crawford is the first to apologize if you guys get in like an argument? 
Um, honestly, Crawford. Yeah, Crawford's the first. I'm learning to not be as stubborn as I used to be. I actually both, it's, it's been both. Cause this is the first relationship that I'm in that we actually like talk about it right then and there and fix it. It's Friday too. It's the first time ever, all my other relationships, we would literally like bottle it and then like table it. Toxic. I just say, I'm like, you're being annoying. <laughs> Do you remember when, this is a really fun memory. One of the last memories I have with Neza is you remember when we went to all the way to literally Compton? <laughs> yes. <laughs> we can't say for what. Can just we? Yet. No. Yeah, they talk about it. Do they really? It comes out. <laughs> yeah, and then remember Kristen hit her car. Yeah, how could I forget? It was quite the day, and you guys will understand soon enough. But well, no, they won't because they weren't with us the whole day. Where we were in traffic for like six hours on our way to Compton. True. This is our first video filming on my channel where it's just you and me. This is true. Like, what do we do? Like, I know we're supposed to trash talk our boyfriends, but like, I feel like you're like so nice to Crawford. Uh, uh, I just, Crawford's, I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> say say it, I'll bleep like, it. I can't. Say it, I'll bleep it. I was gonna say Aw, Crawford. <laughs> He's gonna hate that, but I'll bleep this part out, yeah. but. <laughs> Tara! Tara! Tara, you know what? You have Girl Scout cookies? You want some? And they're just sitting there? Go, go take some. Oh my goodness. Why do you have so many? Because Girl Scouts come to my door and they're like, knock, knock, knock. And, oh, look, why Sugar's ready. Sit. Sugar's ready. <laughs> you can't have chocolate, you will die. You will die with the chocolate. Who's the worst texter? Which as I know, it's Crawford. Oh, are Hello. you kidding? You're not the best texter either. Crawford's the worst. But he thought, even when we were talking, like I thought he wasn't into me because at how bad he was at texting. I thought he was just like trying to go. I'm sorry. Yeah, he's really Are you spoiled. being sassy? Yeah, he's so spoiled. He's what do like, you want? He's saying, give me a cookie. I can't give you the cookie because you'll die. I have another question that's not on the list, but like, it's okay. not a question, it's more of a statement that I kind of mm -hmm. want to like, kind of close the video with because it's going to be like an eight minute mm -hmm. video of us just like blabbing. Something I really want to say that I've said before and I'll say it again is when that's when Crawford first started dating. Oh my gosh, yes, Tara didn't know. Tara was so out of the loop. I was Everyone around. Was out. Everyone was no. out of the loop, right? No, I was around. I was around, I was around and around, and I didn't know anything. And then you know what I thought, and I knew I knew, like I knew everyone knew, because I was like, oh my God, they're such cute friends. Like they're so <laughs> sweet to each other. They're like so close. Literally, no, I remember no, that day they were exactly, like, exactly too, and you were like, they were banging. What? You were like, <laughs> <laughs> You're like, what? Okay, yeah, we'll, end it, we'll end it really sweetly. What's your favorite thing about Crawford? My favorite thing about Crawford is I like when he goes blonde. I think it really suits I him. I love him blonde. I think the reason that he's blonde right Why did now, I not say my favorite thing about my own boyfriend? Because, my, my favorite thing about your boyfriend I is blonde. I think he looks really good blonde. No, I... He, I think the reason that he's blonde right now is because he knows I like him blonde. Oh my god, I've, been, I've just been sitting like this with like my pants up like this high this whole entire time. <laughs> I also am wearing Adam Sandler pants. Carver's was one of the sweetest people. Mm. Even as a friend before we started dating, one of the sweetest human yeah, beings right. ever. So nice. Really? Like, like overly nice. Like I don't know if you know, but he like bought Dylan Will a camera. Oh. He didn't post about or anything. He just bought them a camera because he felt like it would help. Mm. I don't know what you want from me. I can't really say much about Jake because I said it in the last, you said video. In last video. Um, and then I feel like I'd be just crapping on him too much. I will say though, sometimes I had to talk with him because he only takes backpacks on trips. And he's going on a 10-day trip to Europe tomorrow. I'm like, are we dating the same person? We might be. Literally, we'll go on a week trip and he will take this little tiny carry-on. Tiny, tiny. And I'm like, babe, we're going to dinner every night. We're doing yeah. this, we're doing that. And then he'll he'll pack some of his stuff into my big suitcase. Oh, same. He's like, oh, let me put this stuff because you're checking the bag. And then I'm going to put my he's like, in And it. then he's like, I don't see the, the point in like a big thing. And I'm like, and then all his clothes are just like crumpled, crumpled. up in oh, a tiny little. One time I went to Kansas with Jake. Thank God we were in Kansas with his parents because like, I think he ended up like borrowing old underwear. Yeah. He bought one pair of underwear for like five days. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't check, but it was probably Skidmark City at that point. <laughs> On that note. Thank you guys so much. Thank for you so much for watching. <laughs> Thank you for sticking around while we got Harry tickets. We trash talked our boyfriend. Let me know who you guys want to see next on this series. Go please subscribe to Neza. Go Ooh. watch all her. Thanks. Go listen to her music. It's actually really good. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Tara gifted me merch. Go get it. It's super cute. I'm gonna rock it every day. Aw. Yeah. You literally rock by the purse I give literally, you. Literally, like, guys. Day. I have like a sh ton of bags at home, and I literally wear Tara's bag every day. <laughs> like this video. Subscribe. Go follow my Instagram because a lot of you don't follow it. It is. It's time, time to skedaddle. skedaddle.
Do you understand? 